Hey, what is up guys? This is Immortal Vibes coming to you again with another video. Immortal Vibes aka Kemar aka Tony Infographics. Pick anyone you want to call me. Alright guys, so let's start off this video and I want to give a big shout out to Demetrio Guerrero, number the second. You know, sorry if I mispronounce your name, but I'm speaking about this guy here. He has been a frequent commenter on my videos. He has liked my videos and continued to give me encouraging thoughts and words. I hope you share the content as well. Guys, please share the content. Like, subscribe, leave a comment below, check the description for my websites. And remember, subscribe. Alright guys. So what we're going to do today is we're going to basically look on lip syncing. I'm going to look on how to actually lip sync in Tony. So for lip syncing that lip action, let us use a female here. All right. So what you're going to do is you're going to put your character there in the center of the screen. You know, then after that, you can either record an audio or add music. You actually have free music inside Tony. So here you go. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put House Targaryen Game of Thrones. I'm gonna put it as music here. And after you do that, now you have your character set out. You're gonna actually go in the animation settings, then and type, click it. Then you're gonna look for lip syncing. See lip sync, and the track that you're gonna play is. Oh, sorry, I said you're gonna you can put it in music too, but no, you can't put it in music. You have to definitely put it inside here. This section, the voice overlay section. So in order to do that lip sync thing, what you're gonna do is you're gonna basically do all of that and then you go into tracks, host again in Game of Thrones, whatsoever it is, whatsoever it is. So let me recap. Let me go over that, guys. So in order to do lip syncing, what you're going to do is you're going to actually put down the character in the center of the screen. Then you go in the animation settings, type lip sync, track, put the track down inside the audio section, not the music section. I'm glad you guys saw that mistake that I made a while ago. It doesn't work when you put it in the music section, you know, so you guys learned something else today extra in the video. And then you click the track that you want. You can have multiple tracks down here, but you click the track that you want. You get me, guys? You can also record your lip syncing capabilities. You get me? But basically, you do that. And now that you've done that, you save it. And then you play it. See? That was basically the song just starting. You get me? Now, in order for you to use that feature, you can actually record your voice down here and put it down there or you could put in an audio track now let me do something else along with that too let me put in one of my previous videos audio tracks to show you guys how you can actually do more lip syncing with that you can do it with music because i just showed you you get me and you can also do it with your own audio track that you pre-recorded or you're gonna record look at hey, this good night people look at this so make sure that you select the track. I'm selecting inner piece. No, the video you're basically see? about preserving it. If you see that her mouth is moving, basically, it is actually moving in the same way that my voice is going. So it looks like she is talking, and that is how you do lip sync. Inner guys. piece. Again, see? man. See? So yeah, remember to like, subscribe, leave a comment below, guys. Thank you for watching the video. And I'm going to be putting out more content on a regular basis. Subscribe to see the content, like, subscribe, share the content, and I may just show you out in my next video. Thanks again, guys. This is Kemar signing out.